Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Most of the times this is normal, but sometimes it can indicate a pregnancy that hasn't occurred properly in the uterus. If the spotting persists or worsens, it could mean an incoming miscarriage. You will have more severe morning sickness because of your twin pregnancy. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. If you're pregnant with twins or another multiple of babies, you might have a greater chance of first trimester bleeding due to causes like implantation bleeding. Miscarriages in the first trimester are also more common when you're pregnant with more than one baby. Make your mark, take our lead. A baby bump is not typically visible at six weeks. A perceived baby bump may be attributed to bloating. As pregnancy progresses, the uterus grows and expands to make room for a baby, but at six weeks this growth is usually only seen by a medical professional during an ultrasound. Take our lead. Miscarriages are more common with multiple pregnancies, so a little bit of spotting can be cause for concern. But spotting is also more common with a multiple pregnancy. In the absence of cramping or large clots, spotting doesn't mean the end of your pregnancy. Talk to your doctor if you're having bleeding or spotting. Take our lead. While feeling ravenous may be an early indicator of pregnancy, it's unlikely for this to be your only symptom. In fact, many women find their appetite actually decreases in the first trimester, as morning sickness makes the sight and smell of food unappealing. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. With a twin pregnancy, your body makes high levels of pregnancy hormones. So morning sickness may come on earlier and stronger than if you were carrying a single baby. You may also have earlier and more intense symptoms from pregnancy, like swelling, heartburn, leg cramps, bladder discomfort, and sleep problems. Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. In the first trimester, spotting is somewhat more common, but should also be reported to your doctor or midwife. Call your obstetrician especially if you notice heavy bleeding similar to a menstrual period to make sure the bleeding is not a result of pregnancy complications, such as an ectopic pregnancy. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.